Hi guys and welcome back to another Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 tutorial on the channel. Today we're going to be talking about how to get a frame rate counter and a stats counter in your simulator without the use of any third party programs. Before we get into the video, I first want to give you guys a big, big shout out for reaching 200 subscribers on the channel. It's absolutely amazing stuff. Uh, I want to thank all of you for the support I've been getting. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright guys, so here we are and we're going to do a couple of simple steps to get the FPS counter running. What you're going to want to do is you want to go into your settings menu like that. And you want to go to general settings. And under general settings, you're going to go to developer settings like here and what we're going to do now is we're going to put on this developer mode and you're going to hit save and apply and it's going to load in there we go that works and we're going to go back into your simulator and as you can see a bar has been appeared um, on the top of your screen a black bar with settings for developers and what we're going to do now is you're going to hit the options button over here in your toolbar. And under rendering, there should be a button called display FPS. So we're going to be hitting this button. And as you can see, your FPS counter has appeared on your screen. The top numbers over here, the biggest numbers are your FPS counter. I'm getting 47 FPS right now. Um, under that is your response time which is 21 second, milliseconds for me and um, you can also see your uh, resolutions you can see some rendering stuff and you can also for example see your CPU memory usage and your GPU memory budget usage which are quite useful stuff to know so you know you're on the right settings graphically speaking so guys that's basically it uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it useful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for future content. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.